What's up guys? We're out here on the Nola Chucky today. We're finding some of these Helgramites, Grampuses, whatever you want to call them. We got a fair amount of them right now. We've only been out here for like 20 minutes. Just uh, finding a little island next to the river and flipping over rock. And I mean, it's not that hard. My baby could be out here doing this. And these are actually going to make the single-handed best bait for this river that I have ever found. I mean, sure, you can chuck a worm around for half an hour and catch a couple bass. But, I mean, you can bring, like, 20 of these out in a boat and catch, like, 60 bass in 30 seconds. Dude, it's ridiculous. Honestly, if you're fishing for food, like, for bass, it's not even fair because they just like them so much. The one thing about them, though, is they're not out here, like, year-round, like, this thick. You can find, like... A couple of them on later in the year but late april early may is definitely the best time to come down here and get them before they start pupating and turning yellow because right now it's like these things are like the toughest bait ever also i'm not kidding when i say you can bring like 20 and catch like 40 bass because these things just don't die but yeah we're gonna flip around a couple of rocks to see what we find and hopefully do some fishing when we're done There you go, folks. I've had this rod casted out for like a minute and a half, maybe. Just started the GoPro recording. Caught this nice three pounder from the Nolichucky River. Not a bad start to the day. Another fish on. This reel sounds awful. Another fish on here. Oh, I can't I'm not even kidding, guys. These rods are not out for more than three minutes whenever I'm getting these bites. There we go, guys. Fish two. Six pounder from the Noble Chucky River on the live Helgramite. Let's get it back in there and give it about two minutes and see what else we can pull up. Fish on. Number three. How many of you got Dave? I'm actually going to play that in real time so you guys can see just how fast that fish fought whenever I threw that out there. I mean, it is like the fastest action you will ever experience whenever you're fishing with these little boogers. Looks like Dave is doubling up with me here on something. It is a oh, turtle. It's a, <laughs> a soft shell turtle. Ah! <laughs> Get that thing away from me, dude. Can't you. I know, I just don't like them. There you go, boys. Fish number three. And let's see that turtle, dude. Stinks. And a soft shell turtle. You know, I actually want to eat one of those one day. Someday. Fast action out here, boys. Y'all gotta go out and find some of these little boogers. No way. I don't believe that, dude. That's not possible. I really Look don't how believe big that. that is. Dude, this is the biggest. Uh, I don't even know what kind of uh, bait fish this is. It's a shiner, but, dude. but literally, what just happened was he just got my line out of the mess that we kind of made out there. And this was sitting next to the boat. And as I was dragging it in to cast it back out, this like four inch shiner just just tried to take my two inch Helgram. <laughs> We're out here doing multi-species work and that's the second fish that I've caught on this Helgram. I caught that last bass on this same one. And if you were to make a mistake, this dude could still bite you and I promise you it would still hurt. Oh, Dave, is, has Dave finally got his first fish? 
first fish of the day for him when I already have four. Here you go, boys. All right, boys, we're calling that a day. We got to pack them up and head them home. But uh, overall, we had a great day of fishing today. We fished for about 30 minutes. That's it. We were Helgramite hunting for like 45 minutes, maybe an hour. Found maybe 60 Helgramites. Caught, we caught, I caught three bass. Dave caught one bass. Caught a shiner. He caught a turtle. I mean, all in all, I'm not complaining. Like the video, comment, let us know what you thought. And if you haven't already, subscribe for at least two videos every week.